Why don't lions attack when you're on a safari? A safari in Africa is a unique and exciting experience where tourists can view lions in their natural habitat. Lions are apex predators that are found in various regions of Africa, such as the savannas, grasslands and woodlands. A safari typically involves traveling in a specially designed vehicle, such as a jeep or a truck, that allows tourists to get close to the lions while still maintaining a safe distance. The guides who lead the safari are usually experienced and knowledgeable about lion behavior, and they know how to keep a safe distance from the animals to avoid any potential conflicts. Along with lions, safari-goers can also expect to see other wildlife such as elephants, zebras and giraffes, as well as experience the natural beauty of the African landscape. Where can you see lions in Africa on a safari? Lions can be found in various regions of Africa, but some of the most popular destinations for lion safaris include East Africa, countries such as Tanzania, Kenya and Uganda, are home to some of the largest lion populations on the continent. The Serengeti National Park in Tanzania, the Masai Mara National Reserve in Kenya, and the Queen Elizabeth National Park in Uganda are all popular safari destinations where tourists can see lions in large numbers. South Africa. The Kruger National Park in South Africa is one of the most popular safari destinations in the country, and it is home to a large population of lions. West Africa Countries such as Senegal, Burkina Faso and Niger are home to a small population of lions, which is known as the West African lion. This subspecies is considered to be critically endangered and the population is only found in a few protected areas. Central Africa Countries such as Cameroon, Gabon and the Central African Republic are home to lion populations, although the population density is relatively low. North Africa In the past, Barbary lion, also known as the Atlas lion, was found in North Africa, specifically in the Atlas Mountains of Morocco and Algeria, but they are now extinct in the wild. It's important to note that lion populations have been decreasing over the years due to habitat loss and poaching, so it's important to do research and choose a reputable safari company that practices sustainable tourism and that has a good track record of conservation efforts. What is a safari? A safari is a journey or expedition typically to observe or hunt wild animals in their natural habitat. The word safari is of Swahili origin and means journey or expedition. In Africa, safaris are often associated with hunting big game such as lions, elephants and rhinoceroses, but in modern times, safaris have become primarily focused on wildlife viewing and photography. Safaris can take many forms from guided tours on foot, by vehicle, by boat, or by hot air balloon to camping and backpacking expeditions. They can take place in a variety of locations, including national parks, game reserves, and other protected areas. How dangerous is a lion safari? A lion safari can be dangerous if proper safety precautions are not taken. It is important to follow the guidelines and instructions provided by the safari guide and to stay in the designated safari vehicle at all times. Additionally, it is important to understand that lions are wild animals and can be unpredictable, so it is important to maintain a safe distance from them. It is also essential to do your research on the safari company and ensure that they have a good reputation and follow proper safety protocols. In addition to following the guidelines and instructions provided by the safari guide, 
It is also important to be aware of your surroundings and to avoid any actions that might provoke or agitate the lions. This includes avoiding sudden movements, loud noises, and direct eye contact. It's important to understand that even if lions appear to be calm and relaxed, they are still wild animals and can be dangerous if they feel threatened. Overall, wild lion safaris can be exciting and provide an opportunity to see these majestic animals in their natural habitat. It's important to be aware of the risks and to take the necessary precautions to ensure a safe and enjoyable experience. So, why don't lions attack cars with people on safari? Lions are apex predators that are found in various regions of Africa. They are known for their strength, power, and fierce hunting skills. However, when it comes to safari vehicles, lions generally do not attack them. There are several reasons why lions do not attack safari vehicles. Number 1. Recognition Lions are able to recognize objects that are not part of their natural environment. Safari vehicles are large and unfamiliar to lions, and they do not see them as prey. As a result, lions do not feel the need to attack the vehicles. Number 2. Size and Structure Safari vehicles are typically large and sturdy, making them less vulnerable to attack from lions. The vehicles are also built with reinforced exteriors and reinforced glass windows, which make them difficult for lions to penetrate. Number 3. Distance Guides who lead safari tours are experienced and knowledgeable about lion behavior. They know how to keep a safe distance from the animals in order to avoid any potential conflicts. This helps to ensure the safety of both the lions and the tourists. Number 4. Habituation Lions that are frequently exposed to safari vehicles can become habituated to their presence and will not react aggressively towards them. Number 5. Human behavior Tourists and guides usually respect the lions and do not behave aggressively towards them. This can also help to avoid any potential conflicts. It is important to note that while lions may not attack safari vehicles, they are still wild animals and can be unpredictable. It's always important to follow the guidelines and instructions of the guides and to respect the lions and their natural habitat. It's also important to note that lions may attack when they are threatened or if they are attracted by some kind of food, for example, if tourists feed them. In conclusion, lions generally do not attack safari vehicles because they recognize them as something that is not part of their natural environment or prey and because the vehicles are typically large and sturdy, making them less vulnerable to attack. Guides who lead the safari are usually experienced and knowledgeable about lion behavior, and they know how to keep a safe distance from the animals to avoid any potential conflicts. However, it's always important to respect the lions and their natural habitat, and to follow the guidelines and instructions of the guides. That's all for today. Thank you so much for watching, and please don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell button. Until next time, farewell.